Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I'm going to compare Google Password Manager with 1Password. The first thing I'm going to compare are the main advantages and disadvantages, then I will go on pricing plans and then I'm going to look on main features. So I'm not paid by 1Password or Google to say one is better comparing to the other. I'm just going to give you my honest review. And honestly, uh, the main reason that I like 1Password more comparing these two tools is that it works with any browser through extensions. So extension and can be used on your smartphone or any, any app or browser at all. It also works across iOS and Android. And if you are on a computer that isn't yours, right? You can just install the extension from one password and you're good to go. You get every single password that you need. And in addition that I like is that you got a watch over here and you can see right here, the comp compromised websites that you use, reused passwords, weak passwords, it checks everything for you. The second thing is that one password uh, got the AAS two five six protection that is like like really good protected. And Google many times they are canceling their own product, so you never know that they can like easily delete your um, all your passwords. The next thing is that you are actually slave to Google, and I don't know how else to say it, but you're using their product. You are using everything's connected to Google. So good luck using Internet Explorer or Firefox uh, with uh, your saved passwords that you got. Now, I have many passwords here only because this is like one time and I didn't need to save them anywhere because I don't actually use this. So this is the first thing. And the second thing, uh, what I want to talk to you about, there is an advantage to Google is that it's actually free. So if you're like, I don't know, five passwords and you don't really care if you're going to get compromised, you can use Google. Because you're going to pay uh, for one password. You can see right here, you can free trial for 14 days. You can also check it out in the description. And then you need to like pay after 14 days and it's annually. So it's not monthly. And you can have like one password or one password families or for your even team. And this is like really great. If you want to go with a family, go with one password. If you want to go alone and have like three, four passwords, Google is good for you. I'll be damn honest. But if you want to have like credit card, look at this. If you want to have go with the credit cards, with the passwords, with your bank account, with a wireless router and have everything here, membership, email accounts, I would go definitely one password and just use it to the full advantage. All right. So from the privacy standpoint, I would choose one password. And now what is also good that if you got like someone and family or whatever you can uh like if you will have like family plan retard entertainment you can have it like with family members bank utility can be your with your wife or husband right so in this way one password is top notch and yeah that's pretty much it also a one-time passwords so google is like basic thing and i'm a demonist it's a basic thing and it's all right but it's not that deep. The security is not that great. And one password is just winning here, but it's a paid product comparing to Google. So thank you very much everybody for watching. Have a great day and goodbye.